Hey, this is Tamara, signing on with some more of Little Nightmares. Okay, um, hmm. Last time we managed to evade the long arm thing, and now we're trying to evade, uh, OB Chef. Sorry, I'm really not getting into this game right now, and I'm just trying to power through it. I know that's a bad attitude to have, but, hmm. these. Actually, now that I look at it, it looks, I don't, this sounds stereotypical, that's not, that looks Asian in design. Maybe that's the lady from the opening second, or the opening few seconds. Yeah. I think there's a way I can actually get up there. I think that's just a scenic thing. I think maybe this was just a hideout for me to check out real quick. What is that? Just a cam? What is that? Okay, I think I gotta go back down the dung waiter. Gross. Okay, I gotta put meats in the thing and grind up some sausages. What'll that do for me? Might be better food. Kid, if you get hungry again, you should just eat whatever's around you. No, it's probably made out of children, but you did eat a rat, so... This just looks like ham. I'm guessing that's all. There's another one, I'll get to it. Oh, I gotta make the sausage links. Okay, I get it, it's a rope swing. See me through the box?
I just want to see if he's actually coming up. There he is. God damn it. Nope. Get under. Mm. Okay. I saw no reason why he needed to turn that direction right where I was going to be. Right where the only path I was headed. Mm. Sorry, I don't mean to be such a grump about this game, but come on. I'm going along the walls because it, it's like that's the safest way I'm supposed to go. I'm following the cinematic path so I can watch this guy tear this pig open or whatever. Ugh. I'm going the most logical route, and then the game decides, okay, he's got to prescriptively turn that way. Oh, you just happen to be there. Yeah, it's he triggers when I get to this point in order to move, and then he moves when I get to this section, and then... Sorry, some of these guys work on triggers, where you, once you're in a certain spot, then they start to move. You can actually see moments where their animations kind of cut to do this specific action when you're in a certain spot, but it just slows you down. It doesn't help me. It doesn't even creep me out that he got that close because... The guy's not scary. He's just annoying. It's not just him. It was the same thing with the long arm dude. section like that, I'm surprised he hasn't already caught up or heard me, uh, you know, heard me grab the key running, because the only way to get through that in time was to run. I'm surprised he didn't hear me as soon as I took off. statues. Help. I see now the curves and the There is two of them. Thought so. There's no way I wouldn't be right in that guy's eye line, but 
Surprise, surprise, they spotted me, but that guy wasn't gonna turn his head. No, sorry, I didn't know where to go there, so I have to go back now, try to figure out where those hooks are coming from. <sighs> so, and sometimes the checkpointing is awful. I'm surprised I didn't start all the way back at the beginning of that spot. Normally, that's what the game would do. the camp now that I'm thinking about it, in this situation like this where's the other guy I can't see him so I don't know if he's ever gonna be able to spot me because I can't see anything he better move We're starting from here. No. What am I missing here? Did I? Of course. Okay, what am I supposed to grab onto then? Okay, so you can climb up these goddamn pots and pans, really? Ugh, okay. 
That's how we get to the hooks. All right, whatever. Sorry, Thump. I don't see what makes the pots and pans more distinguishable as a climbable object than anything else. I know there should be that mentality of, oh, just try everything, but come on. He can reach me from there. It curves just right in the way in order for him to do that. So I got to drop down even though that looks like it could kill me if I drop. Oh, come on. It looks like a fall that would have killed me if I dropped down. So what the hell? Come on to the hook. Sorry, that looked like a fall that would have killed me, so I wasn't sure if I actually had to do that or not. Dro just drop down. It looked like it w uh, mm. I'm sorry. This game is just starting to... It's almost too obtuse. I like a puzzle and I like a chap. What? I thought I was in the clear. What the hell? I thought it was in the clear. I thought it was transitioning me to the next. Oh. Yeah, the thing knocked me down. What the hell? Did I fall off on accident when I wasn't paying attention? Okay, I thought I went through the crack. I must have looked away for a second and fell off. I don't know what happened. What, sh go back to the replay. Huh. This game. Okay. Done with the kitchen. Please tell me we're near the end because I can't take much more. I'm trying to stick it out, but God, this is starting to get really annoying. Where am I going? I'm pressing... I was pressing just right the whole time and the camera shifts and suddenly it's telling you to go fly off the edge. ship onto this one. The water looks really nice. <sighs> For a seagull to just snatch me up. Oh, those are just more chefs? Whoa. Yeah, there's more fat guys. Pretty formal attire. What are they here for? Buying slave children? What's the deal? Is this about to go ending of inside where just suddenly it turns into a one weird mess? I'm not even sure how much, what the time actually is. How much of this did I actually play and how much I'm going to have to cut out because of all the bullcrap deaths.
you're running on a curved object. You go off course a little bit because the camera angle decides to change on you. Well, you're, that's your fault, isn't it? Not the game's fault, it's... Eh. <sighs> Sorry, I'm really starting to... God damn it, did it again. The camera angle changes, and even though I'm trying to go as straight as possible... Okay, maybe that was my fault for running. But at the same time, the camera angle, as it changes, it also changes up your controls. I was trying to just press left as straight as I could, and it just pulled me straight down. I swear, I'm not making ex excuses. This is just what the game is doing. It changes slightly. I'm holding left, straight left, because that's how you start, and then it just slowly changes so you angle more to just fall off. You guys have too much of the chef's cooking. But now why is everything certain look all oriental? Who's the lady there? She was the one from the beginning. She's the one statues I keep busting. Who's she? Does that guy even have eyes? I think I see him. What the hell? Okay. Interesting. Okay, so that was more of, I didn't know to dodge the table, but try it again. Yeah, you can see that guy's eyes just barely. Run! I was holding run and he wasn't running. Probably should wrap up here in a bit. I can crawl pretty fast for a chubby guy. What's up with this? These people just want to eat kids? You guys. I'm running away this time. What? Well, am I just gonna sacrifice this thing to these monsters? He's 
phone, I can't do anything. Should be wrapping up. It's gone on too long. I don't know what, how much I gotta cut out yet or how much actual gameplay there is in this video because of how many times I died trying to figure out the stupid... I have a feeling I gotta use them for bait somehow, but nothing's working. guy didn't do anything for me. I don't know, I'm so confused. Okay, we're gonna wrap up here for right now. Next time we'll try and figure out this next batch of nonsense this game's gonna throw at me. All right, so until next time, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe and all that. This is Tamara, signing off.